What's up, everybody? Thank you for joining me today on Hogwarts Legacy. Uh, today, we're going to be doing some side quests, and we're going to be jumping into the second trial for Rockwood. Um, hope you guys uh, enjoyed the episode, and don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and bell notification. And thanks for coming to RWG. Deke would like to talk with you when you have a moment. Okay, Deke, what's up? Hello, Deke. Professor Weasley said you wanted to tell me more about the loom. Ah, hello. Uh, yes, about that. Deke has had a thought. He... What's going on? Seems the room thinks you need more space for your beasts. As Deke was saying, uh, oh. he's had a thought. Now, Deke knows how you can test the item of clothing that you enhanced in the enchanted loom. Okay. And uh, perhaps help an old friend in the process. What do you mean? A house elf named Tobbs works for his master, retrieving leech juice in a cave near Hogwarts. Tobbs' master doesn't let him leave the cave. And Deke knows the cave is infested with spiders. That okay. sounds awful. It is. Deke hasn't heard from his friend for a while now. As the item you wove in the loom has an enchantment that might be useful, Deke thought you could test it whilst checking on Tobbs. Okay. I understand. Leave it to me, Deke. I'll find Tobbs for you. Oh, thank you. Please let Deke know what you learn about Deke's old friend. I will. We have more room for beasts now. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so let's see where this place is. Jump to here. This must be Tobbs's cave. I suppose I should head inside. Okay, well, let's check this cave out. Your quota by three files. You know what that means. It involves this in the promise of human chicken social. You guys will follow your state. We'll be given enough food for a week. I'll just put you in. Punch yourself on you when I return for the next shipment. That's some bloody bandages instead of the usual Yahoo grin. If you do not meet your next quota, plus five extra five files, you will lose more and then get food. Food privileges. <coughs> Dobbs' master is awful. Yes. Revelio. Oh, let's see what we got. Tobbs. Tobbs. Deke sent me. Are you in here?
Incendio. Good bring them. Incendio. Expelliarmus. Defendo. Okay, what do we got here? Go chest. Okay, else? Rebellion. Nothing else in here. Spiders are obviously. Expelliarmus. Defender. Confringo. Incendio. Expelliarmus. Good for you. Defendo. Oh my god. Expelliarmus. I know you guys saw that. Rebellion. Huge. Expelliarmus. Can bring her. Expelliarmus. Incendio. Can bring her. Oh, that's scary. What the heck? Incendio. Defend him. Confringo. Expelliarmus. That made me jump a little bit because it happened to be just right there. Like, I jumped. Uh, where is that big spider? It looks as if Tops was here some time ago. He must have headed deeper into the cave. Incendio. Expelliarmus. Confringo. Defender. Potato! Incendio! Expelliarmus! Confringo! Incendio! Expelliarmus! Kill them before they kill me.
Tops. <coughs> it seems he has dried up all the leeches here and must move deeper into the cave. Tom hopes to master him away from him in return. It's much too dangerous for us to follow, and please be careful with spiders. That didn't sound particularly reassuring. Oh my god. Incendio! Some more health back. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Okay. Protego. Let's go. Expelliarmus. Incendio. Two Fringo. Defendo. Down. Protego. There's just a big spider left. Oh, jeez. Did I do it? Did I finish it? Is it dead? Depulsor. Revelio. It's dead. 
you stuck in a wall? That's weird. Rebellion. See if we have any anything good in the gear to help us out. Locked. Okay. And that one's locked. Okay. Incendio. That big spiders. Expelliarmus. Incendio. Feeling that house elf is Tobbs. Tobbs? Find Tobbs' body. The big spider is too much. Tobbs has failed. He even deserves his punishment. Tobbs was weak, sleepy. Tobbs must. Poor Tobbs. Left here alone with the spiders. Poor Tobbs. Well, time to finish us off. The big spider. That table looks familiar. Seems I'm back at the entrance to the cave. Okay. But I want to find the big spider. Okay, let's keep going. Let's see what else we can find down here. <laughs> ah, is that it? Rebellion. Oh, 
Okay, let's tell, tell, tell deep what happened. Rebellion. Okay, let's do a quick check on our gear. Okay. I'm back from the cave, Deke. <laughs> Wonderful. Uh, uh, Deke hopes you gave Deke's best to Tobbs. I'm sorry to tell you this, Deke, but Tobbs is gone. It seems he was unable to avoid the spiders in the end. Oh, oh man. man! Deke was afraid of this, alone in that cave for so long. Oh, poor Tobbs. Uh, Deke and Tobbs once shared the same master. When he died, uh, we were separated. Deke always wished Tobbs had been sent to Hogwarts, too. Deke feels lucky to serve such kind witches and wizards like you. Deke will miss his friend dearly. And we'll raise the glass to him with a heavy heart. <laughs> I'm truly sorry about your friend, Deke. Thank you. You are very kind. Deke could use some time alone to think if that's all right. Okay. This is actually a downgrade. Okay, guys, we're gonna go make some. Maybe? Let's see. Yep. It's a money wall potion. No, it's a black sweet today. Let's go the hogs need. Welcome. Come on in. Now, where, where was I? Right. Oh, yes. <laughs> now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with.
thank you. No one can say I don't keep a stacked shelf. Oh, my dear biscuit. Hello there. Thank you, what can I do for you today? To see you again. Farewell for now. Um. something I took out of his own chest. What can I do for you today? I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Okay. Let's quickly look at our quests. So, this is the map chamber. Uh, we need to go grow some flax weed so we can get uh, a pendo, a uh, steel memento. We need to do that one. We need to get the sendo also. We need a troll bogey. Well, these are all the spare ones. Let's do Where did that one. Um Alright, so we need to go find a troll. Okay, so we need to find a troll buggy. Buggy. Booger. Whatever you want to call it. Hogwarts is very lucky they've got protection charms, if you ask me. Seems like a quiet night.
Okay. Um, let's check out. Let's see. So we're going to go to Fieldcroft. Okay. So Fieldcroft. We are related, so. I need to find a troll. An intruder! Trolls are just goblins. Just goblins. Yeah. No trolls. I've been at this for hours. Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. Find a troll. So 
such arrogance. Abandoned long ago, no doubt. Rebellion. We gotta find a troll though. I mean, we can probably go buy one. I just. I'm supposed to find them. I wanna try and find one. I was only following orders. Leave your accusations in someone else's direction if you don't mind. that real quick. Okay, that's two. Come 
more work. Then we'll go buy a troll bogey. A lamb to the side from me. A terrific expression. Not a party to attend by myself. Show yourself. Okay. Let's go back to we go back to Hogsmeade. Let me know if I can be of any assistance at all. Yes. I hope to see you again. Farewell yeah. for now. All right. Those are done. Let's go back to Hogwarts. Let's go. Welcome back. Have you finished your assignment? Reporting back, Professor. Assignments all finished. Well done. Shows good discipline. Wisdom is a golden snitch, as they say. And you're proving a skilled seeker in that regard. Let us practice our restore momentum. A charm, incidentally, created to stop Quaffles from plummeting straight to the ground during a Quidditch match. Precise, deliberate movements. Okay. There we go. Slows the motion. Very good. Now, where do we put it? There. there. I recommend practicing your new spell as much as possible. Expel it. Perhaps before you leave here. Arrest the momentum. That's it. Keep it up. Awesome. 
Okay. Hey. Now on to the other one. We're gonna go. Alright, so we have to go to the flux weed, and then we'll be done with all of those things, and then we'll go on to our next quest. Let's go grab some flux weed. Wait. Oh, I need a large pin. Okay. So we're gonna go ahead and Can't do it. Oh, I gotta go purchase it. All right, well, we're gonna go. Take this. I'm gonna do it. No, why do that? Right, we're gonna go to. some flux weed. Let's see if we can go for one. There we go. Go to the other side that way. Do I have one here? There we go. Where? 
We have to buy it. Professor Garlic, a moment of your time? The plants are resting, so now's as good a time as any. I was wondering, what made you want to teach herbology? How lovely of you to ask. I've always had an affinity for greenery, so this situation is a bit of a dream come true. After graduation, I was thrilled to be asked to step in for my old herbology professor. He'd had a slight accident, you see. Oh dear. A shame for him, but it worked out well for you. Hmm. Well, he never cared. I mean, really cared for the plants, and they could sense it. Oh, you'd be surprised how perceptive a plant can be. At any rate, the trouble began one day when he cut into a wigan tree. Unfortunately for him, its leaves were hiding a bow truckle. You may recall the marvelous creatures that resemble a twig. The little beast gouged the professor's eyes quite fiercely, but terrifying, I'd imagine. Uh, likely for the professor, too. Okay. And that's when you took over as the herbology professor. Well, not quite. After three weeks at St. Mungo's, my predecessor regained a tiny bit of his eyesight. He insisted on returning to the greenhouse. Within a week, he had, he claims by accident, kicked a Chinese chomping cabbage. So it was back to St. Mungo's for him. That's kind of <laughs> a bit of bad luck there, I'd say. Hmm. Well, I felt awful for him, but I dare say I felt a bit more sympathy for the cabbage. Upon his discharge from the hospital, his indifference to plants had turned to utter disdain. He lost what little patience he had left with a particularly temperamental venomous tentacular, and, well, his resulting leave of absence continues to this day. Oh. I'm glad everything worked out as it did and that you're the herbology professor now. Very kind of you to say. I do love these gardens and helping my students grow. Huh. Lovely speaking with you. Have a wonderful day. Oh, and remember, be kind to your Wigan trees. Alright, we got a tomb of stone. Should have done this while I was there, so we have to go to... Right there, tombs and scrolls. Then we go grow, and then we'll move on to the next thing. This is cauldrons. Oh, where's where is it again? On the other side. There we go. I'd rather scrape cauldrons than work with them. Take your time Here looking about. Plenty of wonderful books to stoke a curious mind oh, like yours. Oh, yeah, I saw some stuff that one. A pleasure doing business with you.
Nope. Nothing like finding just the right thing, is there? Uh, there's most of our money now. Back to Hogwarts. Minutes. All right, so a lot's going on. Let's go ahead and we have a couple more things you have to do. Um, let's go ahead and attend a class. Leviosa. Leviosa. Check those out on a later date. I do wish I had a bigger trunk, though. The galleons and a historian's uniform. It was brilliant solving those old treasure maps. <laughs> I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Revelio. <sighs> Ironically, I didn't see ahead of time how bored I'd be in divination class. Uh. 
Okay. Okay. Let's go What do we have here? I hope those assignments were challenging enough for you. I've completed all of my tasks, Professor Renoy. Very well done. Although I must admit, I did have something of a premonition that you would follow through. Well, now, thank you. As you have no doubt sharpened your perception by completing my assignment, I am curious. Based upon the knowledge that one's present and even one's past may reveal traces of what is to come, what do you see in your own future? I see, I see good things. After all, the future's mine for the taking, and I shall take what I must. Hmm. The future is not etched in stone. It can be carved out by those with very strong wills. And you do seem to possess one. But this talk of tomorrow should not divert us from your present success. I shall inform our good deputy headmistress of your exemplary performance. And if that performance is any omen of what your future may hold, then I, for one, see great things. Channel your magic towards your targets. Okay. You have it. Now, why not practice the new spell? Excellent. I think wow. you have it. <laughs> Arrest on the left. Cool. Yes, yeah. that's done. Okay, on to... Now, let's go... Let's go back to the room or fire it. Real quick. And see how eight more minutes. Okay. Okay. Nice. 
Alright, let's go ahead and throw some new gear on. Sell that, nice. This can give us some more defense. Some offense. Alright. And we'll get a talent. Nibbler. Alright, so we're gonna go to our other place and drop off our other two pieces. Let's go do that real quick. We go to our other location. Worked. Three more minutes. Rebellion. Defender, Confringo, Incendio, Expelliarmus, 
Defender. Glacier. Guardian Leviosa. Lumos. Glacier. Accio. Leviosa. Wingardium Leviosa. Repulsa. We're almost ready. Two more minutes. I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambience. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? I'd like the room to feel mysterious and eerie, as if I'm in the forbidden forest, surrounded by shadows. Mm, sounds perfect. Okay, let's go ahead and go do what I need to do. So we're going to more plus garlic now. Okay. 
There's the professor. Perhaps a hybrid. Bouncing tentacular. I've finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful. I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. I am forever enraptured by it. Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. Well, if there's one thing I love to see more than my plants thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. Now, ready to learn flippendo? Chin up, keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. Okay. You will want to focus with this spell. Nothing as mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few parts. Okay. Wonderfully done. If you'd like to practice a bit more, you're welcome to do so here in the greenhouse. Just mind the plants, please. Okay. Okay, so let's go ahead and clean up a little bit. Professor, I was wondering where you're from. What's your background? Oh, how nice of you to ask. Well, let's see. I grew up in London, right on the Thames. That sounds lovely. All the sights and bustle of a city. To some, yes. I used to dream of living in... I suppose that makes sense. Well, um, you see, as a child, I knew nothing of... It does? I wasn't... Okay, now, time for us to get back on the path. All right, guys, we're going back to the map chamber. You would be wise not to underestimate this student. Their aptitude for magic is beyond anything I've ever seen, and I've been teaching a long time. It is a joy to have such a student. It can be. There you are. Hello, I've received your owl. I was able to speak with Lord Gok, the goblin I mentioned before. What did you learn? He and Ranrock were close once, but they had a falling out. You believe he can be trusted? I, I believe he's trustworthy, yes. He seems sincere, and Sirona Ryan trusts him. Very well. Supposing he can be trusted, will he help us get to Ranrock? I retrieved a stolen helm he hopes to return to Ranrock in order to regain his confidence. You have been busy. Let's hope your efforts result in our learning something about Ranrock's plans. 
Lord Gok did yeah. mention that Ranrock is searching for something, but he couldn't say what. Perhaps that helm will yield some answers. Ranrock is searching for something? I feared as much. I've heard an unusual amount of activity, goblins and wizards, I surmise, when visiting my portrait at my castle. Rookwood yeah. Castle? My former residence, yes. That castle is also the location of your next trial. I'm sorry to tell you that Victor Rookwood, evidently your descendant, is a dark wizard in league with Ranrock. My descendant? A dark wizard? Uh-oh. I'm afraid we've no time to waste. Despite the obstacles that clearly await you, you must get to Rookwood Castle immediately. Not only is it the location of the next trial, it is home to a source of power that would be devastating in the wrong hands. I do wish we had the luxury of time. However, I do not doubt your abilities. Find my portrait there as soon as you can. Very well, sir. I'm on my way. Best of luck. No time to waste. I'll meet you at Rookwood Castle. Okay. On to Rookwood Castle. Oops, wrong one. There we go. That's a big map, dang. I didn't realize it was all the way back there. So where's uh this castle? Oh. Okay. We haven't been assigned the quest yet. There it is. Okay, Rookwood's Castle. Okay, we're gonna jump over to Fieldcroft. We're gonna go take care of this, guys. Wonder who lives here. Okay. So if you remember, I, I flew by this earlier in the episode, so... Goblins everywhere. I don't want to work with goblins. Not now, not ever. Rookwood gone mad. Okay. Over here. Hey, Professor. What's going on here? Professor Rookwood was right. The place is crawling with Victor Rookwood's lot and Ranrock's loyalists. They're working together, all right, but it is not a friendly alliance. I'm sure you'll agree that we need to find a way in other than the front gate. Let's go. Okay. So, we gotta find our way in. Oh. Oh. 
could simply manage to uh -oh. bring me the child. We wouldn't need the child if you hadn't sent a dragon to retrieve the container I spent months and countless ministry favors tracking. Uh-oh, here we are. You let them board the carriage. My options were limited once I knew it would be inconveniently beyond my reach at that infernal school. Have you not acquired enough power here? I allowed you to tunnel under my family home. Allowed me. You are here only because you are descended from a keeper and may at some point inadvertently become valuable. We had oh, an agreement. Geez. I will share with you the power that I discovered if you locate the stores of magic that are yet to be found. So, unless you want another demonstration of my power, a power that you one day hope to wield, Bring me the child. No. Uh -oh. uh oh. We already knew they were after you, but now we know they're digging for stores of magic. And Ranrock knows about the keepers. Yes, I caught that too. Professor Rookwood said that you'd understand more once you complete the next trial. Let's get into that castle. Bring me a dozen I'll uh, take off. Any special words you want me to pass on to your mum? What are your folks on? I'll make you. We go from here now. It's a Potato! 
Incendio. Accio. Defender. Wow. Did it. Right, let's see what Rebellion. Look like. Chests. Perhaps not the best place to be caught alone. Rebellion. Okay. Cells that were in. Okay, we're going this way, guys. <coughs> okay, here we go. Castle. How do you get down there? I suppose that's the quick way down. Careful now. The pulsar. Is there something to those symbols? Descender. There is. I've seen symbols like these before. I need to find all of them, then cast at them quickly in succession. Alright, so for those two there. Um Seller. Okay. Goblin tracks. They're a step ahead of us. Let's see where they lead. Uh oh. Who's this? This must be it. The store of magic and the source of Branrock's power. It looks empty. If they've taken all of it, why are they still here? Branrock said there's more to be found, and if he's right about that, it may or may not be located here. Wherever it is, we need to find it before they do. Revelio. Where is that portrait? This way. There's a portrait. I heard something. I was hoping that was you. Hey, Charles. Professor, Professor. Rookwood, the goblins and dark wizards who've overrun your castle are digging for stores of magic. 
and have broken open some sort of container. No. Things are more dire than I could have imagined. If, as you told Percival, a goblin in his vault was wielding a powerful magic, then they have somehow learned. It cannot be. And, sir, they know you were a keeper. Ranrock used the term. This makes no sense. How did... We shall discuss this later. Right now, you must complete the next trial. Okay. Just tell me where I need to go. The power you stand to wield must first be fully understood. The trials will ensure that. Okay. Power without knowledge is dangerous indeed. In the wrong hands, we will simply have to outwit Ranrock. And my unfortunate namesake. Very well, Professor. Tell me where I need to go. I shall reveal the path. Professor Fig must leave you now. Okay, Professor, have a good day. See you later, Professor. I would join you if I could. I shall await your arrival in the map chamber. Thank you, Professor. Here we go, guys. Trial number two. The second trial. So that's where I have to go. Revelio. Oh. We got in the Yosa. I need to reposition that pillar to climb out of here. Perhaps the archway is the answer. Ooh. Wingardium 
to move it. Go this way. Oh. Oh. Guardian Leviosa. Not these again. Oh, jeez. Here we go. Pensive. Also, Akio. Propendo. Expelliarmus. Propendo. Incendio. Confringo. Expelliarmus! Incendio! Confringo! Expelliarmus! Incendio! I believe I need to proceed to the left here, but how? Ex 
Some to hit the mark on the far wall. So that sort of thing has repositioned the archways in the past. There's a pillar here, but no ledge near it for me to grab onto. Pillar. Nope. Okay, what do I need to do? 
more box. Hitting those marks readjusts the archways. Perhaps there's a way forward from the other side of this one. Oh. We got him, Leviosa. Akia. We got him, Leviosa. Okay. Is it possible to pull one of those blocks through the archway? We got him, Leviosa. We got him, Leviosa. I get it now. Akio. After pulling the block out through the archway, I can place it where it can be climbed on while on the other side of the archway. We got him, Leviosa. Again. And just move like it always does. Nice. Okay. Now what? stuff. Come on, man. 
Revelio. in the center. Okay, so we have some hidden. Expelliarmus, defend us! Who's breathing? 
Holy moly. That took forever to do. That thing was rough. Oh, we got it, guys. What a relief. Oh. oh my gosh. That thing was tough. Okay, guys. Well, oh, another pensive. Okay. I'm gonna get out of here first. Let's, let's get the chests. Rebellion. Okay, we have a pensive here. I'm curious to hear of Isidore's travels. Do you come in? Please, have a seat. Isadora. Okay, We are all most intrigued to hear. We're ready. I've something to show you. Father... These are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. Oh no. On my travels, I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain. Okay, so what are you doing? Isadora. Oh no. no, 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 what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What have you done? I took his pain. That's not, that's not what you're supposed to be doing. You don't take pain. This is uncharted magic, Isadora. You can only see what has been sealed in the jar, and we do not know what power that may hold. But the traces of that magic are different from what I've seen before. Oh, no. Thank you. That's... That's the stuff that Renrock's looking for. That's the stuff that Renrock's looking for. That's not good. Not good at all. Okay. You're back. And in one piece, no less. I am. It is good to see you again. Professor Rookwood told me about what happened at Rookwood Castle. In light of the dire circumstances in which we find ourselves, it is most fortunate that someone so competent is following this path. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep the second artifact safe as you've advised. Good. Are you ready to move on? What, what was the glowing strand that Isadora pulled from her father's chest? Yeah. It was pain. You will understand more about her actions as you complete the trials. Okay. I'm ready for whatever comes next. In that case, introductions are in order. Oh? Allow me to introduce former Hogwarts headmistress, Neve Fitzgerald. 
Miss Fitzgerald. Professor Fitzgerald. How do you do? I must say that I was not entirely surprised to learn that a student had been completing the trials. I've always believed Hogwarts students capable of anything they set their minds to. Thank you, Professor. It's a pleasure to meet you as well. I am certain that you are more than capable of completing my trial. However, I must first, how shall I say, prepare the location of your next trial. We trust your judgment, Professor Fitzgerald. You should know better than anyone how to manage the inconvenience of... well... A vainglorious and exasperating headmaster? Indeed I should. I shall confirm that everything is in order immediately. Okay. Of course. Professor Fitzgerald needs some time to clear the way forward. Until then, you should continue to hone your magic. If you learn more about Ranrock and Victor Rookwood's activities in the meantime, please let us know. I Very will. well, Professor. I know, I know. Continue to hone my magic. You do learn quickly. Hopefully you will soon hear from Lodgok as well, and we shall learn how he fared with the helmet you retrieved. Well done today, as always. We shall speak again soon. Okay. Oh, it's winter. Winter time. Okay. Let's look at the gear real quick. Let's see what we got. Nothing good. Okay, guys. Well, that is it for today's episode. So we'll see everybody on the next episode of Hogwarts Legacy here on RBG. You guys have a great Thank rest you of your day. Thank you told me about your run-in with the poachers. I have some news about them as well. Can you meet me soon? I fear that some of what I uncovered has to do with you. When you have a moment, please stop by the Room of Requirement. Deke mentioned you might be interested in learning how to breed beasts. Okay, we'll see you around the next episode. I have been asked to teach you the exploding charm, Bombarda. Once you have completed the tasks I've set forth, speak to me after class. Alright, everybody, we'll see you around the next episode of Hogwarts Legacy and RBG. You guys have a great rest of your day.